how many buckets of gravel will it take for me to build a smokehouse? That's interesting. Why don't we count and we're gonna find out. As I attempt to find out how many five gallon buckets of gravel it takes for me to build this smokehouse, something absolutely amazing happens at the end of this video. You've gotta see this, I couldn't, it, my mind is blown right now, check this out. sure if this is gonna be enough gravel for my smokehouse. If it's too much, I got other things I can do with it, but <laughs> might need to get another load. This might not be enough gravel for the smokehouse. and I are hot and sweaty. I don't know how many this is, but this is hopefully enough for my dual purpose hot cold smoker house build. Let's see.
It's already 10. Thirteen. Fourteen. Fifteen. How many grab I got? I must get them five more. more, right? Yeah. I should have set my stone in here. Twenty. Twenty three.
Could be too high for the door. Yup, that's not gonna work. Okay. build it up around the edge.
side. What's it? I could. But I'm not really... Huh. You think I should fill on the sides? Yeah. Interesting. Interesting. I wasn't thinking of anything. Yeah, good! You still got stuff you're doing in the house? I was just about to start on my uh, reading lesson. Awesome. Then I would highly recommend you go do that. Alright. See you in a little bit when I'm done with my reading lesson. dump these over and spread them out over there. So I'd like you to help spread. You can pull everything out of there. I'm going to try to kind of throw this one in the back. Oh, son, sure. run and grab the other, um, 
the, the, the saw. The saw is all? The, 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 the circ. Saw. Circ saw? Yep. Four more, but that's not all. Hey, that's the... This is the circular saw, right? Circular saw. It's got a big circular blade on it. This is the one, right? That's a jigsaw. It jigs up and down. The big circular saw. The dinner is ready. Dinner is? Yeah. Uh, okay. Um, would you save me a plate? I just got quite a bit I'm trying to accomplish before sunset here. What's that? What did you say? You have quite a bit of work to do. What's that? Keep on what you said. I said I got quite a bit I'm trying to accomplish while I can still film today. I don't even know if everything got unloaded from the truck. Right. You know what we were talking about before? Yeah, yeah we're going to put a railing up. But I think we're going to use our big board up there. Alright, this thing got a battery on. Good. Okay, bring the big board over. So, crazy, 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 crazy interesting thing. When I did this, I had 56 buckets full of gravel that my son and I went and harvested. We went and got 56 buckets. 
I used exactly 56. That is insane. Now, since then, some of them have been refilled with rocks. I'll use it on my rock pillar fence. A bunch of them are still empty. But really, I gave a good, almost two foot wide thing all the way around here. Same thing over here. I did everything I wanted to over here. I did everything inside with the floor and everything under here. And every last bucket was used. All 56. So a little interesting to think of, you know, most people don't go, how many five gallon buckets of gravel do I need to build a smokehouse? But in this case, I have good reason for the stuff I did. I wanted it kind of burned up around here so I'm not getting water down in there. I wanted the inside built up, wanted that thing around the uh, cold smoker part there. It's easy to work the stones in there too, so. I actually am doing the grand opening of this right now. There's two carp in here, uh, a turkey I just killed last night, and then there's some beef liver and oxtail in here too. This is going so well, and we've got a whole playlist of stuff if you guys are interested on all the different steps in this process, and kind of the intro video, and eventually the, uh, the full video on it too. So, really happy with the project, and I used a lot of five gallon buckets of gravel. I'll see you next time. Papa out. That's because you know.